Welcome back, guys, to Deus Ex, the original. We're right where we left off, having just beaten the terrorist bad guy, and now we're going to go to an Echo HQ, which is not under lockdown anymore. So, this episode will just cover what's inside here, I think. Uh, there's a lot to do in it. We've got the island secured. How did things look in the statue? The leader surrendered. So they were after Ambrosia. A month's supply for the East Coast. We think they've taken it back to the city. I didn't know Unatco handled the Ambrosia distribution. Manderley will brief us shortly. Unatco makes sure the limited supply of vaccine gets to government agencies and key industries. It's good to finally see some action. Just keep a level head. You're doing well so far. Now get inside. I'll meet you in Manderley's office, level two. I'm not sure, but I think if we'd taken that much more violently, he wouldn't have said we're doing well so far. He'd have been the more disapproving of us. Right. Yeah. Can pause that if you want to read it. I think I read it before. Ooh, pot. I hear you just slipped by a lot of the terrorists. Pretty smart. Yeah, I am pretty smart. Thanks. Ammunition is disappearing. It's my first day too. That. I'm pretty excited. <laughs> Break these pots? No, I can't. We haven't got the strength for it. But I believe these trophies will not fare so well. Ah, oh, come on. Check in with Manderly on ah. level two. Let's break all that pottery. Screw you, Manderly. Oh, that was oh, that was pro skills then. Okay. You can see how loyal you Nakua agent I am. Trophy doing the best agent ever. And he look, I have mind powers. Come on in. The retinal scanner can read blood vessel patterns right through your sunglasses. Okay. Another low image. So yeah, in here we've got lots of people to meet. Remember that lots Mr. Manderly wants to see you. Level two. Oh, His secretary, great Janice job. Reed, has your login and password. Ha! Goodbye, trophy. Hell of a first day. So what have we got in here? We've got an accuracy modifier. I'm not really interested in accuracy or ammo, so I'm not going to break into this room with my lockpick. There are better rooms to break in for me. We finally got to cap some rebels, eh, Denton? What have we got in here? We've got a lockpick. And I presume there'll be something else in here, so I presume it's a lockpick for a lockpick and something else. So there's no loss in doing this. Yes, multi-tool, brilliant call. And I believe it's on the desk. No, I'm just making a different desk. Ah, we'll take this. <gasps> oh, damn it, it's a pretty resistant pot. Right, this is our office. <sighs> you found your office. Did Janice give you your login? I guess not. Let's see. JCD password Bionic Man. JCD password. There's nothing much useful in here, but Bionic Man. So, I'll just scroll through these if you want to read it again. Pause it. Right, well, I think we've got something in here. Something of use. We've got some books, I suppose. Blah blah blah, exposition. Right, in here we will meet our fellow agent, Agent Your Navarra. Your partner for the next assignment, Anna Navarra, is in the adjoining break room to the east. Maybe you should introduce yourself. Right. This cabinet's not got much use for us, so it'll be a waste of a pick, really. We could explode it open, but that may not sit well with the other chaps around here. Nothing here. Chuck 
a conversation. Are you sure you pressed the right button? I do not make mistakes of that kind. Your hand might have slipped. No, I wanted orange. It gave me lemon lime. The machine would not make a mistake. It's the maintenance man. He knows I like orange. So you think the staff has some kind of plot? Yes, they do that on purpose. <laughs> so yeah, we got this is the guy we could have saved, but didn't. My new partner, JC Denton. Don't tell me you're going to wear your sunglasses during a night operation. Yeah. My vision is augmented. Better to look good than to have the distractions of another agent who needs backup. Forgive my interruption. I just wanted to say that I look forward to working with you, Agent Navarra. Snuffo, excuse me. I've got to be briefed by Mr. Manderly. I do not expect you to perform as well as Agent Herman, but the mission will require us to do oh, more than frighten the NSF with our baggy coats that make us look bigger than we really are. Oh, I am prepared to perform my duties. For instance, not to wipe out the enemy and then leave agents still captured in a locked cell. No problem. No, that was just tactical genius that the likes of you cannot appreciate. That's true classiness when an agent does that. Shows that he respects his enemy. Get your check up on level 3, and let's it's get going. Right, so we've got a few more bits to look at this. We're not going to go into Joseph Mandley's office yet. Another door in there. This door, we will find a... In there, there is a key for it, so it's best not to waste lockpicks on these doors. Instead, we should go down a floor. Level 3. Before the briefing, you've got to go to level 3 for your equipment and a medical examination. See Jaime Reyes in the med center and Sam Carter in the armory. Yeah. Sit around somebody's room. Amazing mirror reflections. Isn't that just... Admittedly, the roll on my screen is going right in front of my face, whereas on the other screen it's by my hand, but... Early 2000s. Okay, so let's go to meet Gunther Hummel. Actually, no, that's not the first place to go. Yeah. At ease, Agent Denton. General Carter, I read about the Merced operation in school. This is a great honor. I'm not a general. I can't believe what the NSF did to your family. Enough of that, soldier. We each have our troubles. I lost my children, but you've had to grow up without your parents, which requires more courage. I don't think it matters. My parents died in a car accident. That's different. I said that's enough. You have your own op and time is short. How about I issue you a stealth pistol? That sounds fine. Thank you, sir. What else do you think you'll need? Right, I think we're shorter on the tech tool right now. Can you spare a nanotech tech tool? A man who uses his head. I like that. Now move out. Manderley's waiting. Hey, what about that guy out front selling munitions? Is that allowed? Oh, Kaplan, right. We've got some screwballs around here, but he's not the problem. It's whoever's been breaking into the armory. Awesome. Someone at Unaco's a thief? Awesome. Yes, sir. Damn good one. Hell yeah. What's well, your fault for leaving the passes around, really? I'm not sure if he can break into here and steal all the. Well, I presume you can because you can see a nano key just over there. It might be a later mission. A pistol is more than adequate. Hell, I dispatched a whole platoon one time with a pocket knife. <laughs> okay, so we're not going to go that way because there's a passcode that we need to get. This X one of the computers. So I'll go to medical next. Some nice loot in there, if I remember rightly. Got a Metroid. To heal us up. Oh, apparently we're fully health. Okay, we got us. We can either get microfibre muscles, strength increase, or melee weapons. I think we know which one we're doing. Install. There we go. Uh, that's just all the. Augmentations we can get. Run silent would be a lovely one. I don't know where to get many augmentations in this game though. Okay, here we are. Here's another key. Closet key. Uh, that's the floor, the top floor. You old kidder. Let's hack this computer using icebreaker. Hey, JC. You look like the real thing. They actually let you operate on people? Just fix Gunther's knee, in fact. A sticky actuator. So far, I feel more like a mechanic than a doctor. I'm impressed. 
They actually let you point a gun at people. We'll have to catch up later. I've got to leave for New York right away. Could you send Manderly whatever it is he wants? No problem. Listen, JC, about your augmentations. You know they're preparing to roll out the technology worldwide, right? As long as I don't turn green and grow a pair of antennas, as I understand it. Yeah, well, the design's pretty modular, which means you'll soon have access to upgrades from standard augmentation canisters. Great. Have anything for me? Not yet. But remember, if you find one of these canisters, that you need a med bar for installation. I'll do that. The canisters contain a colloid of ROM modules. Some are generic upgrades, others require you to make permanent choices about how to configure one of your subsystems. It's about time they implemented some of this stuff. Report to Manderley. He told me to send you back to him on the double. Okay. There is some more stuff. I think I remember if you can get, you can get a throwing knife for this guy, which is useful for distracting people. Like the flares. And you hear the lead. Huh. Just holds the dedication. Microscope. Still another room, I think. Oh, yeah, we have the key for this. Uh, we need to get rid of the inventory thing. Let's put the stealth pistol out. Go down the medical I presume. Excellent. I believe there's two of those rooms. Well, I thought it was. Ah, I must be mistaken. Oh, well. Now we'll go to Alex Jacobson, the chat screen just on our headphones. You're getting warm! Nice they gave software to break into some computers. Okay, you had to read these quickly. Because when that bar gets to the bottom, eesh, we get alarms at us. Right, so got, ah, here we are. You're red hot. German's Looks password. Like you found me. Zeitgeist for German. Lots of music. Lots of bad textures. Uh, ah, there we go. Another thing here. Okay, enough goofing around. <laughs> like leading a mouse to cheese. This thing is starting to give me a headache. Don't worry, we shut it down when you go off duty. I guess I'll get used to it. To I'm Alex duty. Jacobson, communications engineer. I suppose you already know who I am. Getting there. You're certainly quicker on the uptake than your brother Paul ever was. Thanks. Ever the enthusiast, Art oh, J.C. Denton. Thanks. Ooh, I've got four tools. I'm not sure. I don't know actually what's behind that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bother. Right, so now we know German's password. That was a close one up there. We're going back to his computer. So, hack just to break it. Excuse me, Mark. I have to prepare for the mission. So I'm told off wearing glasses, whereas you like some sort of nanny. I refuse to babysit a grown man. German. His password was Zeitgeist, I believe. Zeitgeist. Okay. Skull gun. And then there's just generic emails. See Manderley on level two and let's move out. Oh, another trophy. I think what has to happen to that. I'll, I'll take a look later. Where are we to not fortune at him? Oh. I am not going to hold your hand. Well, you have your so. orders. Right, down here we've got the prison area. Not much for us down here until later on, a few missions down the line. But... Way to go, sir. Nah, we can look. I got a random NSF guy. Gunther should have followed orders. Yes, he should. It's not my fault. It's a bit stuck in that. Right, let's roll out to Manley's office. Well, we can find I am key not going to closets. hold your hand. You have your. I believe there's level four. I just can't remember how you access. I think you access through the medical, and that's that's a reference to a a much later mission. Okay, so right, we've got just a second. Excuse this detail. Ha! I've ruined all your trophies. Right now, let's see Mandalay. Ah, here we are. So that's 
get to zero. Let's unlock this door. I believe you get a multi tool out of that. I can't quite remember. I remember thinking I was a bit of a waste of time. So I won't open that one. But I don't know, I haven't opened this one before. Ah. What have we got here? Uh, pepper. Pepper. I'm not really interested in pepper spray. In fact, I threw out my pepper spray. Not useful. Hey, I'm trying to work. Uh, password is night to killer. Login is still Jayman Lee. Thank you for leaving your password on the desk. It's so helpful. That will be JC's job. What's that? We waited for that. Power station. Intro. The NSF have Ambrosia in a warehouse protected by cameras and booby traps. We want to power down the whole system. We're taking one illicit generating plant, protected by weak groups of NSF. Knock out that plant, and Paul's team can walk right into the warehouse. Just tell me where it is. The NSF are openly resisting our deployed forces, gradually falling back. You have to deal with them first. And you be ready, Paul. When the power drops, go in and go in hard. I'll use my discretion. Go in like the U.S. Marshals. We lose the vaccine, I'm sending your butt to the mayor to explain why he and his three daughters won't get their pills this month. Yes, sir. Let's not waste any time, JC. Get down to the dock. A boat is waiting to take you and your partner, Anna Navarra, to shore. Yes, get moving. Here's your op bonus for the great job you did in the statue. One thousand credits. We take care of our people around here. The bonus for rescuing Thank Agent Herman you. goes to one of the troopers, though. I'm sure you understand. Thank you, sir. See, we would have got a bonus in with rescuing Agent Herman, but... but uh, uh, it's not worth it. I've never figured out what this is. Teleport. You'll come to admire your partner. Not She's alone. one of our best. She's a maniac. Right. Okay, so I think that about does it for all we've got to do here. We'll meet up in the city. Like, so you couldn't tell this Ambrosia vaccine for the Grey Death is being distributed just to the uh, the upper class and all the business owners. Bet the NSF people. won't try that trick again. And the NSF are trying to do a more equal distribution. What well, that doesn't seem to tick then one is why no more is being produced. Okay. Wish I was going with you. No, you don't. Right. So I think that about does it for this episode. Next episode will um be taking place. Good luck out there. Not Man, a house kitchen now. I can't remember the park's name. So yeah, um, thanks for watching, see you next time.